working with symbols in Adobe Experience Design, symbols are very nice feature. They uh, will save a lot of your time. I will show you, for example, in this page, I have a shopping cart, I have a footer, and in fact, this footer is the same on all the pages. And here I can see all my symbols. In fact, I don't have any of them. So uh, I have a footer and I don't really want to change, uh, for example, address. If I change it here to another address, some new, new street address, that's it. And it's changed only on this page. On this page, it stays the same. So it's way, way time consuming to change everywhere. So for this purpose, I use symbols. I create symbol from this one, make a symbol. So now I have a symbol and I don't want to use this anymore. I want to use my symbols to just clone it, use the Alt key uh, on your keyboard, then it's cloned, the same as in Photoshop and others. You can also use copy function with the short keys on your desktop, on your, on your keyboard, sorry, or First, uh, when you copy from one to another screen, you should select this, this screen uh, and also with the groups. And here this is the old one and we select. When you use shift, then you cannot move to the left to the right. You just move uh, to the uh, up, but, uh, up and down. If you start your shift with moving to the left to the right, then you cannot move up and down, only left and right, it's very useful. So here we have our web pages, our screens with the symbol. And uh, for example, I want to select, I want to delete this one. And when I delete it, it's deleted everywhere because it's a symbol. So use symbols for all the items which are duplicated and then you will save a lot of your time when you're making a prototype. Thank you for watching. That's it.